Bills, Carl Anthony Towns, and Rudy Gobert back after missing game two due to the birth of his son, Romeo. And we are underway. Porter Jr. run off the three-point line, and he misses his first jumper underneath Gordon. Back out to Caldwell Pope. A long two is good. Murray had a tough time in game two, just three of 18 shooting. A total of eight points. Got into the paint, elevates, and scores it. That's a tough one for KCP because you've got a big guy handling the basketball. You don't want to use a hand check on a guy that's not really going anywhere. Anthony Edwards continues to torch the Nets. And he's going to have that shot whenever he wants. That is something that Minnesota is going to concede to make sure you've got an extra body in the paint. Wow. Cat with a deep pull. Looks at his dad, Carl Sr., courtside, as they always do. Jokic took only 13 field goal attempts, Tim, in that game two defeat. Murray off the screen, pocket pass, one more. And there's Aaron Gordon from that dunker spot, so lethal. Two different Timberwolves in the air to contest, but Jamal Murray, very patient that time, gets Michael Porter Jr. an open look. Here's Cat on the pick and pop, and he's two for two. Porter Jr. on the run out. Oh, Anthony Edwards! Pack that on the glass! Off the pin down, Edwards, pocket pass! Picture perfect. Off the nice flare screen, Caldwell Pope. Gordon got the rebound. And Porter Jr. with the lay in. Edwards. Connolly with a nice show and go. That's his shot, the offhand floater. He's a lefty, but he makes it at a high rate. Here's Reed off the flare. Got downhill and lays it home. Nas Reed is on the sheet. Murray guarded by Carl Anthony Towns. Murray in the midi and knocks down another one. Yeah, he's found his rhythm tonight. 30 seconds to go in the period. Here's Edwards. They double team Towns. Edwards on the bounce. Got to the rim and lays it in so quickly and there's not really a backline defensive presence for Denver at the rim. Chris Hines, the assistant coach, has done such a great job with him as Jokic scores with 1.5 to go. And Murray with brevity into the front court. Off the Gordon screen. Towns was in a drop and Murray drops the long jumper. That three ball, the basket looks a little bit bigger when you rise up for that jumper. Speaking of that ball looking really good going through the bucket. Carl Anthony Towns with his third three ball of the game. In the Anderson started the game against Joker in game two. In absence of Rudy Gobert. Caldwell Pope on the baseline knocks one down. Murray with intent off the drag screen by Joker. Underneath. Oh, a little bit of jelly by Jamal for the bucket. Backdoor cut by Caldwell Pope. One more to Brown, an open three, and he knocks it home. Building alive a little bit here. The deficit is at 16. Connolly pulls the three. Make it 13. Timeout Denver. That's great flex action out of the timeout, and they just got Minnesota for trying to hold up the screen and run through that screener before Jokic got the shot off. Porter Jr. inside at the layup. So on the kick out, Nas Reed's out of position, and it's a back cut by Jokic, but it's set up again by that pace. That's his second foul as Joker knocks down the long two. He's three of six. Seven on the shot clock. Edwards got Murray on the switch. Nice feed inside. Alexander Walker with the slam. Joker. Cross court, Brown one more to Caldwell Pope. McLaughlin fell. A wide open Jamal Murray knocks it home, laces a three. Well, Nas Reed has defended him extremely well in this series. The numbers prove it. In transition, out to Towns in rhythm for three. That's his fourth one of the half. Murray with ball pressure on Connolly. Into the corner. 
inside McDaniels with the slam. A nice play to start the third quarter. Get a flow offensively, and then even more importantly, be able to reassert themselves on this end because Denver was very comfortable in that first half. Here's Gordon with the long ball. Three is good. The screen setting much better tonight for Denver. It was a major point of emphasis for Michael Malone. Not enough contact in the first two games on those screens. Great one set that time to get Casey piece of space. Anthony Edwards. Interesting to see Edwards pick up Jamal Murray on that sequence. Aaron Gordon, who had a big first half in game two with that jump. As a shooter, which is an afterthought for him. They're giving him the space. He's knocking down shots. Towns around the Gobert screen. Great pass inside. And Gobert with the flush. KCP was next catch and attack. It all leads to an open corner three. Leads at 21 legs. Conley with the lob knocked away by Gordon. They were sitting on that. Here come the Nuggets. Porter Jr. with space. Butter. I love that approach from Anthony Edwards. He definitely has that look in his eye. He takes it home with him. And right now, he's just trying to figure out a way to get this crowd going and get some run going for Minnesota. And on cue legs, he knocks down the step back three. He's Joker helping out KCP. He gets the switch with Porter Jr. onto him. Got downhill with the left hand. Oh, mid-air pyrotechnics from Ant-Man. Quick ball reversal to Jokic, guarded by Naz Reed, who's done a nice job on him so far. This time, Jokic with a big-time hook. Jokic has scored the last six. Throws it up for Gordon, embracing his bounce from the dunker spot. Murray got picked clean by Anderson. It's a three-on-three, three. Reed for three, got it. Murray off the Joker screen. Gordon out to Joker. Got the three off in time on target two. Alexander Walker goes underneath the screen. Now fights over this next one. Got a contest, but too late, says Reggie Jackson. The energy and the vibe in this city was so palpable today in the air and the excitement. Uh, for Minnesota, they expected to take control and put Denver on the brink. Maybe a bright light. Going to the break. Triple handoff to Murray. Got caught up in the air and turned it over. McDaniel in a foot race. Punched it over Brown for the bucket. And that shows you how comfortable they are right now because you're playing with a big lead and they're coming one pass up the floor and shooting a three. Just getting into their offense. They're not going to change their aggressiveness. They left them alone. Joker missed it, tipped it home. And Jokic now with a 20, 12, and 9 stat line tonight. It's a relatively quiet night for him so far tonight. Got ripped from behind. Denver with numbers. Murray skies. He's flying charter tonight, folks. He's let Aaron Gordon Tim initiate. And What's that do for your offense? Well, it's smart, first of all, to, to save the legs a little bit of your guards, particularly Jamal Murray. you got to give him a lot of credit for answering the bell the way that he did yep. tonight based on the way that he played offensively. A lot of attention, obviously, on the frustration he exhibited. Have to find your next play speed as sports psychologists define it. Inside, Luca guards a great pass for the bucket. Right now, they are sitting at 26 assists. That is the most assists that they've had all series. He said in the last game, they had more turnovers than assists, and they gave up 19 points off of those turnovers. Garza with the rebound in the outlet to McLaughlin. But I, I do think it is important to emphasize this, this was about the Denver Nuggets and what they're yes. about. As Anthony Edwards and Minnesota will drop this one 117 to 90.